the enthusiasm that greeted the news of the marriage of the daughter of Senator Major General Mohammed Maguru retired OFR when his friends, colleagues, and other family members got wind of the cherry news, gave glimpses of what to expect when the event finally takes place. Everybody was very upbeat about it and looked forward most eagerly to the marriage as an avenue to give back to someone who has almost been there forever for all of us. The marriage between Zafira Mohammed Mangoro and Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa, which spanned two days, began with the Kamu, a special day set aside for the mother of the bride, to bid her daughter a special farewell. It was indeed a day when the women practically took over all the departments of the ceremony, with just a sprinkling of the male gender. Traditional music was on display as different cultural troops paraded their different types of music. The event, which took place in the home of the bride in government-reserved area of Kaduna, attracted the presence of friends of the Magoros, especially the mother of the bride, from all corners of the group. Saturday, the 5th of September 2015, a day set aside for the wedding fartier to spiritually seal the marriage between Zafira Mohammed Maguru and Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa, who remain indelible in the hearts of Senator Major General Mohammed Maguru OFR, his wife, and parents of the groom. This was an account of the warmth, love, and solidarity shown towards them, with a huge attendance that transcended political, religious, and ethnic diversity of Nigeria. Sultan Belo Mosque at Ongwan Seriki, Kaduna, where the fight year took place, attracted friends of both parents. In attendance were traditional rulers from different parts of the north and prominent Islamic clerics from the different denominations of the Islamic faith. There were also retired military officers and other highly placed dignitaries. This included Kebi State Governor Senator Atiku Bagudu, retired Major General Garba Ushishi, who was the father of the day, former head of state General Abdul Salami Abubakar, GCFR, who represented President Muhammad Buhari at the event, gave her the beautiful bride after the formalities of the paying of the bride price was observed. Of course, Muslim clerics were on hand to take charge of the proceedings. These involved reading from the Holy Quran and special prayers for the success of the marriage. <laughs> After the fatia had been concluded, all roads led to the residence of Major General Garba Ushishi, where the reception took place, with many more dignitaries in attendance. The very simple way of life of General Garba Ushishi, which is one attribute he shares with the father of the bride, Senator Major General Mohammed Magoro retired, with whom he enjoys a long-standing relationship, was evident in the manner the event was organized. The event to formally draw the curtains on the wedding of Zafira Mohammed Magoro and Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa was a grand dinner which took place at Hotel 17 at Tufat Balewa Way on the Lafayette Road, Kaduna. The high-octane decoration of the hall 
which accentuated the entire ambience of the atmosphere, was a strong signal that in these Fira, who is the apple of her father's eyes, was about to be giving a superlative wedding and a most deserved welcome to the prestigious League of the Married Ones. The majestic arrival of Senator Major General Mohamed Maguro to the hall ignited a different spark to the environment. It was acknowledged by the dignitaries who took turns to exchange pleasantries with him. He was supported by his wife and mother of the bride. There were also Major General Garba Ushishi and General Abdusalami Abubakar, who was the chairman of the occasion. The pan-Nigerian disposition of Senator Major General Mohamed Nagoro came strongly to the fore, with the attendance of dignitaries especially from other parts of the country. These are people with whom he had had interaction over the years, either as friends or colleagues. There was a very long list of others who Senator Major General Mohamed Nagoro had offered mentorship and assistance over the years. From different parts of the globe, dignitaries defied all the odds to pay a well-deserved homage to Senator Major General Mohamed Maguro because he's always ready to celebrate his friends too when the occasion calls for it, no matter in what part of the world. The upscale dinner was anchored by multilingual Kazim Osage of KC Entertainment, born of a Yoruba mother and a Benin father. He must have lived all his life in Kaduna. Kazim Osage displayed an incredible grasp of the Quran, which he recited at appropriate intervals in the program, to the bewilderment of members of the audience who applauded him greatly. The entry of the couple was simple but spectacular. They were ushered into the arena in a special way, with the kakaki, the special flute, reserved only for those who are from the royal family. The couple were joined by the groomsmen and bridesmaids, who looked very, very attractive in what they wore. After the opening prayers, which was done by an Islamic cleric, the dinner was formally set in motion by the chairman of the occasion, former head of state General Abdul Salami Abubakar. In his remarks, he enjoined the couple to stick together, love and respect each other, and he prayed for the success of the marriage. General Abubakar also congratulated the parents of the couple on both sides. We have the parents of the group and the bride. Welcome all of you here for honoring this invitation to come and honor the Hira and Sadhus this evening. And on behalf of everybody here, I want to congratulate you on this day. We, as your parents, pray that you have a very peaceful and loving marriage. May the good Lord guide you as you take your first step as man and wife. God bless you. The catching of the wedding cake was supervised by Mrs. Mariam Salihu Ibrahim, wife of Niger's former chief of army staff. She represented Mrs. Aisha Buhari, wife of the president. And they are going to cut the cake after the spirit of Allah. So that they will have peace in their home. They will know that they have Allah with them. So if I just sit here, put your hand. The couple fight each other before they settle for their first dance. <laughs> The 
The groom, Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa, joined the Nigerian Army in 2007 after he graduated from the University of Abuja, where he read public administration. Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa has represented Nigeria in many peacekeeping operations, especially the Darfur Sudan experience. Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa has undergone many courses in the Nigerian Army. These include regimental security, logistics, staff courses, and counter-terrorism courses. He was the Commander Task Force 29th Brigade of the Nigerian Army, Zamfara State. Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa was up till the year 2013, the spokesperson for the Nigerian Army Special Task Force set up to quell the disturbances in Plateau State. The bride, Zafira Mohamed Maguro, studied business management and information technology at the University of South Shire, United Kingdom. The dinner featured other exciting aspects like the Royal Dance. This featured the Kimber Group from Zuru in Kebbi State. They were joined by Senator Major General Mohamed Maguro, who holds the prestigious traditional title of the Galadim and Zuru in Kebbi State of Nigeria. The son of that popular musician from the north, Sir Dubori, also entertained the audience. <laughs> the couple took turns to have a video and a photo shoot with a series of their friends and well wishes before the event finally wound up. The vote of thanks and closing prayers brought the special dinner for Zafira Mohammed Maguro and Captain Silas Ibrahim Mustafa to mark their marriage, which took place in Kaduna, to a final close. Memories will indeed be made of the exciting moments that characterize the wedding, which we pray will be blessed with fruits of the womb.